Well, welcome back to today's more important analysis videos on Monday, 6th of February. The Mirror Japan Market Analyst at Hattic Markets looking at Euro dollar now. We are now continuing to sort of move sideways um, in the last few days and we are really putting pressure on this uptrend. The uptrend sort of held again on Friday uh, with an intraday breach but then closed back above it. We're still breaking down that uptrend again, that uptrend 107.60, we're now 107.45, so we are breaking that uptrend again. And look at these momentum indicators beginning to look tired, rolling over RSI. It's basically been between 55.60 now for the last sort of couple of weeks, really. Um, MACD lines again sort of losing their way on the upside. Stochastics beginning to turn lower, if that sort of confirms with a uh, cross below 70. That um, so below 80, I think that's, that's sort of a negative signal as well. It's all sort of beginning to suggest that this moves sideways. Yes, whilst you're still in this uptrend, it's looking very tired. Can it sort of sustain the move? And yes, it, at the moment, it is a consolidation. Um, and uh, this is the hourly chart whereby basically you sort of found support again above 70.10, sorry, 107.10 which has been a pivot line and also a historic level. Uh, I could go back on the daily chart and show you uh, historic support that's 107.10 is, but uh, it, near term it's um, also throughout January and early February it's become a pivot line as well, numerous times where you've seen it turn around. So that is your initial line of support and I think if you break that you're starting to look a bit more negatively, you're sort of trading below all the moving averages on the hourly. Um, also watch the momentum indicators and the RSI sort of pulling back towards 30 again it's not yet turning negatively configured quite yet but it sort of if it starts to trade consistently below 30 then you're looking a bit more negative the MACD lines have crossed lower again sort of turning down at a lower level it's, it, it's a beginning to lose its way I think this rally um, although nothing's really confirmed yet and you have to really continue to trade it as an uptrend until you get a confirmation of that but I think below 107.10 you would get that 107.10 was Friday's low on that payrolls announcement um, so uh, if you sort of breach that then you're sort of arguably also completing a little top pattern as well and then you can sort of measure that down you measure the arguably the height of sort of one of the smaller tops 108.10 so basically 100 ticks of downside back towards this low here really isn't it um from the 30th so there there are sort of signs of this uh, this uptrend to sort of losing momentum losing its way but nothing confirmed yet um so it's one interesting one to watch so i wish you good luck in your trading and i'll speak to you later